you know, it's a tough, tough place to play over there. They always play well at home. Uh, we're both two and two. We both have the exact same record. I think, um, you know, with both of us coming off of a win, um, you kind of have expectations for the rest of the year that you would keep winning, that you would mm -hmm. build on that. So um, it should be a tough game. What do you see from your team now after four games? Um, I think we're we're getting better. You know, we're getting better each week, and that's kind of our goal is to not peak early, but by the end of the season, playing your best football. Mm -hmm. So I see some improvement on a weekly basis. Valley View always seems to have a tough running type of team. They're out there. They go after you. What do you expect? I'll, I'll tell you, it's a nightmare as a as a defensive <laughs> coordinator because they're they're just fine with getting you know two three yards at a crack and they'll just stay with it. And they've always got big bodies up front, mm -hmm. and then uh, you know quite a bit of deception in the backfield with guys pulling all over, getting in front of the ball. Um, so I'm expecting a, a physical you know 15 round fight. Let's talk about the pods for a minute. This is the first year for them. How are you guys liking them as coaches? It's it's tough to say right now. Mm -hmm. You know, I, I think it'll sort itself out when the playoffs uh, set up and, and they kind of align. Um, and you can take a look at it maybe from a, a retrospective, look mm -hmm. back on it. Uh, right now, you know, it's it's fine because you, you start your season without pod play. So you kind of get those warm-up mm -hmm. games like we used to have in the old days where it didn't really count against your, your playoff record. And so um, I think right now it's probably playing out about – how it's supposed to what's it going to take to win friday night physicality we, mm -hmm. we got to be we got to be physical we got to answer the bell um and as a defense we've got to be able to get some three and outs where mm -hmm. we can stop them otherwise they'll chew up a whole quarter and then uh on on the other side a uh, offensive perspective we have to be really opportunistic because you only get the ball a few times a game yeah, if yeah. their plan goes according to uh, how it's how they have it laid out so we have to be opportunistic on offense and hopefully score quickly and we've got to get some stops on defense make them punt the ball all right last question but it's my toughest question of the night okay and it's a two-parter so now this is going to be really tough on you okay part a what do you like best about the mavericks right now part b what do you like worst or think that the, you need the most work on at this point so part a i, I like um that uh, on offense we we executed last week and guys started um, building a little bit of confidence mm -hmm. there and I think that's real important as we now go into pod play um, the second part is we've got to eliminate mistakes we, we have too many uh, turnovers we have too many penalties that you know uh, are drive killers or drive extenders and um, we just can't we can't lose those details. We've got to pay attention to those details, and it really comes down to discipline. So we've got to be able to uh, play disciplined football.